guys, it is me, Stace. I am back again today with another Toddler Tuesday video, and today's project is super cute. We are making these clothespin treat holders. Aren't they fun? There's a red one there, and then we have a pink one here. Super cute and very easy. The first thing you need are some clothespins. I have just some there. You want to paint the clothespin. I painted one red and one pink, so I have a finished one here. You could, of course, have the little ones use markers. They could use crayons to color the clothespin in. I'm going to take some white paint and the ending of a paintbrush to create little dots on our critter. And again, they can use a marker. Okay, so we have that there. We're going to set that aside. Let that dry a moment. Now we want to create the head. For that, I'm using a piece of cardstock. I tried construction paper. I just think it's a tad bit too flimsy. I'm going to take a lid and trace this. This is actually a stays on lid. Just find something that's circular that about the size you need. I'm going to guess maybe about an inch or so circle. All right. I'm going to take this. And I want to cut two of these out. So I'm going to place it on top of one another. And then just take my scissors and cut it out. It does not need to be perfect. I want two of these so I'm a, I have a spot to sandwich in the pipe cleaners for the antenna. Plus it gives more durability to our little critter there. Okay, finish that, go all the way around. Okay, get rid of that. So now we have our two pieces. I'm gonna take my pipe cleaner. I'm gonna cut about, about an inch and a half maybe. Just guessing. And you can pick up all these things at the dollar store. Probably even the candy. Okay, so I have my two pieces of pipe cleaner. I'm going to take a piece of tape, a small piece, just to hold these down on my circle. I'm actually going to do this circle. It's got that liquid on it from the stays on. Then tape these guys down. Okay, that's what that looks like. Now I'm going to take some glue. I'm using art glitter glue. You could use this. You can use a tacky glue or a hot glue. I'm going to go all the way around on top of the tape take our other circle and put that on top. I want to just squish this down. And while you're squishing this, now you can take the pipe cleaners and kind of curl them out to make them look more like antennas. Okay, just keep on squishing. Okay. All right, we have that. Now I want to add some googly eyes. I think everything is cuter with googly eyes. All right, so I got my little bucket over here. The little ones, they can do like, you know, one googly eye. They can kind of be fun with it. They can do one big one, one small one. How cute would that one be? I'm just going to go with the small ones. All right, again, we're going to first draw on his mouth. You can use a marker. I'm just going to draw like a squiggly line there. I'm going to put some drops of glue there to hold the eyes down. So there's one, and give it a squish. Press down really good. Let's do the other one. I might need a tad bit more glue. And look at the eyes. The eyes just make it. Okay. All right, give them a squish. Now we're gonna come back into our clothespin. I'm gonna take some glue and put a good amount here on the top. That's gonna hold our head in place. If you want to, you could use like a double-sided tape as well. I'm going to take our face, our little head, and squish that on there. And mom and dad can do all this part ahead of time. They can assemble the faces or cut the circles out. I think these are so cute and very easy to do. And great for classroom parties for Valentine's. All right, just give that a squish. Let that glue kind of make contact. Now for the treats. I'm going to use these fun size M&M's. You can use any kind of packaged candy. If you want to use Skittles, you can do that. And what I want to do is just kind of separate them a little bit. So I have nothing in the middle. And just take these, just squish them together. Just center there. Just like that. Okay, squish them together. Open up our clothespin and give it a pinch. And just press down. Then you can fan these out a little bit better. 
How fun, right? It took us like two minutes to make there. So there's my red one, my other red one, and my pink one. I mean, they can be creative. They can do white and pink. You know, they can do blue for the boys, all kinds of fun things. All right, guys, any questions at all, please let me know. As always, thanks so much for watching. Have a great day, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.